Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, we'll be checking out this month's free assets for the month of December. Basically, if you don't know, every month Epic Games gives away six total free assets on Fab. They split up the month into halves. They give away three assets for the first two weeks of the month. I already made a video on those free assets. You can check it out here. Then the second half of the month, they give away again another three more asset packs, which are the ones that we're going to be checking out in this video. There's quite a bit of decent packs this month and also stick around to the very end of the video for a special surprise free bonus asset pack that was just added to fab also don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more future asset videos and content and also comment down below what you guys think about this month's free asset packs so the first asset pack that we're getting is this modular old office pack and i don't know how well you guys can see this it's kind of dark in this scene but basically this is all the different assets that you're getting sort of this modular old-fashioned office and it comes with this really nice chess piece as you guys can see here but yeah, this is the office. You can see we have all this old wooden furniture, antique furniture, old paintings, all the different bookshelf items, and just a really simple scene. You could probably use this as some sort of horror game or something like that. I really like the style of all the different assets. But yeah, that is basically the quality of the different assets. And that is pretty much the level. So let's go ahead and check out the showcase. So this is the showcase level, and again, I said these were all modular, so as you can see, these are all the different modular pieces, things like the doorway, the trim, all that stuff that you can use to make more different additional rooms. As you can see, these are the different couches and chairs. They're not really high, high detailed quality, you know, as you can see, they're more like game optimized. So you can see these aren't nanite detailed, uh, just normal map, which is kind of nice sometimes to get just simple meshes like this. These are the different drawers and dressers. And here are some of the different little props. Again, I like this little cool chess piece and board. Maybe we should make that into an actual playable game. But here are some of the other different props. And there's a rug right there. And yeah, that's pretty much all the different assets in this pack. It's a very simple pack with some nice assets. Now, before we get any further on into the video, I want to tell you about this video sponsor. Have you ever dreamed of making your own video game? Are you tired of watching millions of YouTube tutorials that don't teach you anything? Well, I was in your same position many years ago, and so that's why I created the ultimate Unreal Engine 5 multiplayer survival game course. This course will teach you step-by-step -step how to create a Steam multiplayer survival game inside of Unreal Engine 5 from complete scratch. You'll learn how to create a drag and drop inventory system, a crafting system where you can craft different types of tools and items. We'll create a harvesting system and gathering system where you can chop down trees, you can mine rocks and pick bushes. We'll add a complete building system where you can build a base and a raiding and clans or tribe system so you can raid other players. We'll even add this open world map and show you how to host the game on a server on Amazon Web Services. This course is jam-packed with over 250 course lectures and over 70 plus hours of content to help you get started on your game development journey in Unreal Engine 5. And I made this course because it was extremely hard to get into game development because there was no course like this that shows you start to finish what it takes to make a game. You can pick up the course right now on my website smartpoly.teachable.com or click the top link in the description below. You can get the course right now with a big discount. The price of the course will be raised later on and you don't want to miss out on this limited time offer so take your game development skills to the next level and check out the course link in the description below so next up we have the modular japanese architecture pack so basically this pack is sort of like these japanese buildings so if we go and check out some of these this is basically what the interior looks like i'm not really sure if you guys can see this quite well because of the lighting situation here but as you can see it sort of has these different floors you have a staircase that can go up to the second floor and that's one of the first buildings. I'm not too fond of these packs because there already are a bunch of free building packs just like this one. I believe they're like Korean style buildings, but there's tons of those already on Fab. So I'm not too fond of this asset pack because there's already a lot of stuff like that that is actually permanently free. So it's not just for the month. And I'll show you guys that here in a second. But yeah, this one is like a multi-story sort of building. But yeah, let me know your guys' thoughts on some of these assets. Honestly, I didn't really like this pack too much just because, you know, there's already stuff like this on the marketplace, but it's honestly not too bad of a pack. You can see it's pretty well detailed. And so maybe if you're making a game that could utilize some of these assets, or if you think of another creative way you can use them, 
let me know down in the comments. But yeah, this one has sort of like this courtyard. And yeah, those are all the different assets in there. And all the buildings and stuff were modular. So as you can see, these are the different building pieces, different roof pieces, stuff like the wall, the sidings, all the different doors, the pillars, all that stuff. And what I was talking about earlier with the free Korean buildings, if you actually go into Unreal Engine and search for Korean, they have a ton of these free asset buildings and props already in here. Like, so for example, they already have a ton of these, you know, different style buildings that are permanently free. So I'm just not too fond of this pack because there's already a ton of free content that is quite similar to this asset pack that we're getting. Anyways, the last asset pack that we have here is the Newtonian Falling and Movement Damage System. So let's go ahead and hit play here. So here's our character. I just actually switch out the character in the game mode uh, for me to get the proper character. So if I jump off the edge here, you can see we take some fall damage, our little health bar. Looks like we heal ourselves up. And if we actually jump into the water, we shouldn't be able to take any fall damage. It's sort of like Minecraft where you can jump into a water body and not take any fall damage. So as you can see, we actually still took fall damage there. So maybe it depends on the height, because I think we actually sunk to the bottom. So let's go ahead and try it from up here. So yeah, it depends on the height, I guess. So obviously, if you jump from somewhere super high up, or maybe if I just, you know, just jump down a little bit. Yeah, if your feet touch the bottom, you'll take some fall damage. But if you only lightly touch the bottom like this, it doesn't look like you take much damage. So yeah, that is the fall and damage system. Very simple blueprint system. And those are all the free assets for this month. There really wasn't a whole lot of stuff for the second half of the month. But anyways, let me show you guys the bonus free asset pack that I was talking about early on in the video. If you stuck around to the end of the video, basically I did a review video on the Secrets of Luminar kit from Kit Bash 3D like a month ago. Uh, basically, you could now actually claim these free assets on Fab. Uh, some of you guys were concerned about the licensing that you had to actually purchase a license in order to use these assets commercially. Well, you can actually claim them right now on Fab and you can claim them with a personal license for individual creator or small team with not more than 100K in revenue or funding with the last two months. So you can actually claim them with this personal license and you can use them commercially in your games. So just head over to Fab right now and you can claim these assets. I already did a review video on all the assets in here. So if you want to check that out, I'll link it in the description. But you can now claim these assets and actually use them commercially because I know you guys were concerned about the whole licensing. So yeah, that, that's pretty much it. Those are the free assets for this month, plus a little bonus. Anyways, let me know what you guys think about these assets down in the comments down below. And that's pretty much it for this video. So hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.